Yo what's up guys? Welcome back to my noob to pro series. It is episode 8 of the series. Alright, let's start with story. What is going on it looks like that one. Minecraft texture pack. Look at my units they look so weird. Just got Yugi from the shop, I heard he's a good damage farm unit. His ability is orange based I'm pretty sure. Shall we go try him out? Let's go. This is my first time using Yugi, I think I failed. Yup well, I guess I should have drawn a card earlier. Let's try again. But first let me get a unit that will help a lot. There we go I would have gotten this sooner but, I was doing challenge 3 on extreme. This took me about 2 hours then I looked up a tutorial, and I saw that on normal you can get the orb. The damage doesn't matter but that slow effects plus air, so he slows air that's fire. Water element, okay I guess. Anyways, he's gonna help a lot for orb farming. Now it's time to use Yugi. Uh, I clicked the card and I got the last one my bad. The animation was so cool. Holy crap, 750 billion that's amazing. Even though, I used it a bit early that awesome. Just 8.4 thousand, don't tell me this is the max. Yay no more damage task. Alright, let's use these gems to get a special unit. Yo, I just got Hudson, let's go. This guy's is really good in story, he's full AoE on all his upgrades, so he's goaded. Especially on Familiar Planet Extreme, he'll carry. Anyways, let's go complete World 1 story. There we go, that's the final story level on World. One that was actually pretty fun to do. All of these done this story was really fun, unlike AA. These last two were pretty hard though. Well there we go world 1 defeated now let's do world to story. This is pretty hard should I try using Hudson instead? Yay, Hudson is off bro this was way easier. Let's evolve a special unit shall we? He costs a lot of the aliens. Here we go now, we just need to do Sijin Raid. Nature element, hum okay. Here it is I finally made it some of y'all been asking me to make it so here it is. I also wanted the prey eye ore but it seems I don't have enough materials. Hold up do y'all see that? I used my gems instead of materials. Anyways, let's go check Kira's damage. One hundred twenty million. Wow, that's amazing. I see why people would use this. Sadly, my damage task is done.
There we go wave 90 finished not too hard except, wave 82 that wave was extremely difficult. There we go, I got wave 100 and look we, got a special unit it's Gohan Saiyanman nice. Wow, isn't he really good 10,000 damage with only 1,000 money for placement, wow. We could use him for Marinford Raid and Spirit Raid, since he's electric. Alright, let's summon now. I'm aiming for either Ichigo or Android 17 since we don't need to do infinite anymore. Let's go we got Ichigo, he was the one I wanted, the most I heard from people that he's good. Yo, let's go, the second one I, wanted Android 17, my luck is way too good. So yay I got two units from this banner. Ichigo and Android 17. Huh yo is this Yoruichi nice I never knew, she was a character, mob has a blessing. Anyways, let's go get an orb that will help a lot. Here it is Prey I Orb, this orb increases damage, range and reduces placement cost. Looks pretty cool like a dragon's eye. This orb is like the cost, bomb, and range orb but has half of the effects. A well-balanced orb. Alright, yo let's go do Sijin Raid to evolve Broly. This is my first time doing this raid solo, it actually isn't as hard as I thought. Alright, before we evolve Broly, let's do some raid. Shout out to these guys, especially the guy that brought Cooler. There was only one of us with Cooler. Look at all those coolers. This time I got carried horrendously. Thank y'all for the help. This should be my last one. Let's go see if I can evolve Tanjiro now. Gutaro finally came in the shop. He's all I needed. Hopefully I get two for Tanjiro and Nizuko. Nice, we got one, let's go now, we're guaranteed to get to with pity. Alright, about to get pity. There we go now, I can evolve both Nizuko and Tanjiro. Oh no! I'm gonna need 6 Tanjiros for both of them, so let's evolve Tanjiro first. Uh damn it, it seems we need Fiend too, let me go do, world to story. Bro I did story for nothing, 
fiends came in gold. Banner, well whatever now I got enough. Okay, first upgrade. He looks pretty cool, he started to have blood on his face. Alright, let's do this my first 7 star. Finally, we got a 7 star, I didn't think it would. Be Tanjiro, that's my first. Let's go. I can't express my excitement, the voiceover sounds so monotone. Uh, uh, uh. Anyways, look at that 20% money boost. You see that will help a lot even if it's only a 5% difference. This looks so fire. Bro, why doesn't he have a blessing? It would look so cool. Alright, shall we go evolve Nizuko now? Pretty easy to evolve, got the Tanjiros from Banner. There we go now, we got the brother-sister duo. Sadly she only attacks when enemies have bleed. Okay, so I looked in wiki both Nizuko and Tanjiro are full AoE on placement. Wow. Alright, guys this is the end of the video, thank you guys very much for watching. I apologize I uploaded this late I was waiting for the next update but no, it didn't come. Anyways, I hope you guys liked this video we finally got our first 7 star. Okay, bye bye.